Klinsman is the wrong coach for the USA. Um, I'm sorry to say that. I'm just going to come out and say the truth. He's the wrong man to coach um, USA. If USA want to win this competition or have a chance of winning it or going far, Klinsman is the wrong man. Um, and as, as I predicted, I thought it would be a draw, but Klinsman played the wrong tactics. And I, and I, I was saying this like even before the one zero, especially after the one zero, I was saying they're playing the wrong tactics here. And I think, you know, you look, first of all, you look at that first goal. You could say that, okay, um, it's unlucky. Um, you know, I mean, a guy lost the market. An excellent goal from Zapata. Excellent goal from Zapata. Very, very good goal. Really good, good goal. Because of the, his intelligence run, the way he was able to anticipate the movements and go around the defender and an amazing volley finish. Um, but it's America's approach. If America's approach was, we are here to be defensive, the first thing is defensive, second thing is defensive, and finally the third thing is defensive, they would not concede that goal. A defense-minded team who have um, doggedly focused on defending, marking, defending, being organized, being fully concentrated, do not concede a goal like, like, like that. A defensive team just doesn't concede that kind of goal. And I think Klinsmann's approach is wrong because you're trying to be too open. You're trying to play. So it's almost as if, are you trying to play to entertain the crowd or are you trying to play to win? I think America, you've got to try to play to win. Because if you try to play to entertain the crowd, you lose 2-0 two, two here. You look at the, the, the second goal, it may be a, it's a bit unlucky for the handball, but I think, again, it's America's approach. Yes, you're 1-0 down. It's the first half. It's the first half. You don't need to, to panic. One more goal, you are back in the game. They didn't need to play that, that, that open. Or because if they play that open, it played to Colombia's hands. It gave Colombia space. And when you're playing the wild, wild west, the team with the better players will always, always... 10 times out of 10. This is a little um, bit of um, guru non-knowledge here. In football, if you play the wild, wild west, you play fully open. 10 times out of 10, the team with the better players will always win. A team with weaker players will not, under any circumstance, beat another team f fully open. The only way a weaker team beats a stronger team is by being defensive and making it difficult for the stronger team to break them down. And for America, you have to be you are the weaker team. You are the weaker team. You shouldn't be playing open. Even if you're 1-0 down, you should still be keeping it tight at the back. And that, for me, that's it. That's it. So, for Klinsmann, you know, because now... You have to come out and you've got to win these other two two games. And these are two tough games against Peru and Costa Rica. It ain't going to be easy, Holmes. It ain't going to be easy. But Klinsman's approach is wrong. Why didn't you hire me? Double H, half hope, your boy, your kid, the main kid. And I would have set up America right as a guys, man, you've got to just eat humble pie. You are not as good as Colombia. You've got to be the, the defensive. You've got to give them the ball, give them the ball, and let them tire themselves out and let them play themselves into a mistake but by having too much of the ball and you hit them hard on the counter because you've got that concentration within you. But for Colombia, great start. 2-0, obviously, I'd like if, if Baka had scored, but still 2-0, nice victory. And look, man, the, and for me, very quickly, great goal from Zapata. I've been a keeper before. Kids, if you want... A way to pretty much almost guarantee to, to, to score a penalty. James's, Rodriguez's penalty. That is pretty much guaranteed to, to score. Because of his body shape. His body shape told the keeper I'm going that way. He went the other way. The way he took that penalty. That is exactly how you completely bamboozle the keeper. And you pretty much 100%. If he hits the, the target, you will score. Because you send the keeper the wrong way. Excellent penalty from James. Excellent G from Zapata. Colombia, up and running. I expect them to get at least seven points in this game. They, they, they should beat Costa Rica. They should really beat Peru, but maybe they'll drag against Peru. But I think nine points is definitely on the cards for Colombia. Top the group ahead for them to, to go. So, yeah, they. But I just feel like if America plays to, to their hands, once it was a World War West, Colombia were always going to win because they were the better team. Klinsman. You've got to change your approach. You've got to look at what Simeone Mourinho does. You've got to bring tactics into it. And is Klinsman really a tactical coach? I don't know. I think America need a tactical mind who the main aim is, oh, let's just play nice football the right way. No, you've got to play to win. And to play to win, you've got to look at what your team is 
and how they stack up against your opposition. If they're weaker, you have to play a specific kind of way. That is how the sports of football works. Peace out.